Tennessee has tasted defeat in the swamp a number of times before, but it has never tasted a defeat like this. Tyree Cleveland's 63-yard Hail Mary touchdown catch giving Florida a 26-20 win in a wild and wacky game. I didn't think there was any way he was going to go under and catch it. Yeah, I was just, just really just shocked, really. We still had lots of words. I don't know what happened happened, and I don't want to believe it happened, but it did. The loss is particularly painful after another furious fourth quarter comeback as the Vols rallied from 10 down twice, tying the game on Aaron Medley's field goal with 50 seconds to go. The momentum was in our hands completely, and it seemed that you know, they kind of wanted to go to overtime, and we were happy about that because we, we felt like we had them where exactly, exactly where we wanted them. Everybody believed we were going to find a way to win the football game. There was many times in that game when things didn't go our way where we could have packed it in, and that's not the heart and soul of this football team. The Vols needed the rally because of three Quinton Dormady interceptions, including a pick six, and just three points on six trips into Florida territory in the first three quarters. You can't make silly mistakes like that. You can't turn the ball over in the red zone. You can't back us up and, and make us make a tougher kick for our kickers. You know, there's a lot of little mistakes that, that add up to big things. We'll fix our mistakes, we'll correct them, and we'll be stronger for it. And You know, you have to stay together, and we have to be more driven than we've ever been. Afterwards, Butch Jones said all people will remember this game by is the final play, a play in which Tennessee had its nickel coverage on the field and not dime or prevent with Florida at its own 37-yard line. Still, the defensive rule remains you must stay as deep as the deepest wide receiver. The Vols did not and Tyree Cleveland etched his name into Florida history on this patch of grass in the end zone. In Gainesville, Florida, Steve Lehman, News Channel 5 Sports.